Welcome back guys to some more Pokemon rejuvenation. Um, in the last episode, we got abducted in Akua Town and we pretty much are just like locked up. We're like having a little prison arc. Um, team is not, no major differences or anything. It's really been a lot of dialogue. Um, so we met up, the, we met Saki, Valerie and Adam. And we also got to meet the girl, Emma. Um, and apparently Emma is like on our side, so that's cool. She is interacting with our mom and like our mom's on the island too. I wonder where that's going to go. Uh, but, um, yeah, let's just get right into it. If you're enjoying the playthrough, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and let's have some fun. Hey Robin, did you miss me? Probably not, but who needs the details? So I met up with Val and Adam last night and we decided that we want you to meet a new friend. But this new friend is hidden. I left a clue for you in the library. Check out the bookcase with the purple books. Got it? Get it? Heck yeah. Check out the bookcase with the purple books, you said. In the library. Um, oh, I skipped that. Great, we're pretty excited. We've been considering this since we met you. But if we want to get together and devise a plan to get off this wretched item, we're going to need all of us to do it. Good morning, Valerie. Robin. Is there a problem? Were you aware of the rumor going around about you? The one that says you're working for the warden? That much is true. It's not a secret. We don't talk to people like you. Please go away. Anyway, Robin, have you considered signing up for the tournament at the battleground? Yo, she just ignored her. I think it could be fun. I'll be signing up as well. Didn't you hear what I said? We're not interested. Can you please go away? You're making this so much more difficult than it needs to be. As you wish. Whatever. You didn't stand a chance anyway. Hmm. What? I said Robin wouldn't stand a chance anyway. No way in hell they would. Only weak people get stuck here as prisoners. I mean, just look at me. I'm strong and now I'm on top. Change of plans, Robin. You should sign up and beat her in an embarrassment. That thing we arranged with you can wait a bit. So it's settled then. Good. I'll be waiting for you, Robin. I'm actually not that petty. I think our, what you're talking about, what getting out of here, is more important. But I guess I gotta do this then. Alright. Let's go, Robin. I love you sign up. It's easy. <sighs> oh, crap. I clicked X too soon. Alright. You're all signed up. Not sure what she said there. The tournament shall start soon. I'll be watching and cheering you on. Good luck, Robin. I got this, I think. We're going to lead with Ace just because he's our best lead, I think. Maybe not. The battles will begin soon. Are you ready? The tournament requires at least three Pokemon. Additionally, the tournament will consist of three battles. Winner gets a knight at the procedure. The tournament only allows three Pokemon. Please choose your best three. I think my best three... Can't go wrong with the psychic type. Can't go wrong with a water type and my ace Pokemon, so. Let's begin. This is the beginning of the Black Steeple Tourney. You all know the rules. I don't have to explain them. Begin. I want the prestige room so I can throw stuff at people from above. Isn't that what's the best for all of us? I like how the music started before the battle. It's kind of cool. Little things like that makes it sound more intense. dream my dream it's all ruined i cannot live anymore next <laughs> man i was just visiting a cool town for the aquarium i was just trying to make it back to Kalos. you feel begin sorry man wish i knew how to get us out of here Pull it in. is this pokemon a uh, fighting type yet it's not Or 
breaks him. I shine the Marina in here. Light. That could actually be problematic. What's the last Pokemon? Kroger is. I mean, I guess that was obvious that this was going to be the Kalos trio. Can I leave yet? I don't think so, Chief. I'll leave. I'll just leave now. Next. Did you hear about that Emma girl? I heard she's working for the warden. She's a traitor, an enemy. We should take her down when we get the chance. Knock her off that high horse, Robin. The final battle for the prestige room shall now commence. Don't hold back, or you will lose. Begin. I don't think I'm gonna lose there, but I just need to be prepared. Wait, Meganium learned Shadow Ball? That's not a Meganium. I was gonna say, Meganium doesn't learn Shadow Ball. Yeah, I <laughs> got you. And that was a crit. Alright. Art of War. Kind of behind right now. A another crit? Okay. Don't crit this time, please. Thank you. It's safe. Yeah. I don't think Poison Sweep is the right move to go for. Yeah. Actual Meganium. Oh, that. Oh, it's a Meganium. I'm not gonna lose this. <laughs> Guess I lost. You won. It was a good battle. Hmm. Not so, uh, not so tough now, are we? What can I say? Robin is an extra, uh, extraordinary trainer. I wasn't good enough and I lost. That's how it goes. Underneath the candelabra in the prestige room. I left something there for you. Don't forget the candelabra. Candelabra. Underneath the candelabra in the prestige room. Guard, make sure to bring Robin to the prestige room at the end of the day. Yes, sir. That was amazing, Robin. The way you bodied her was just... It filled my spiteful heart with glee. And now you get to stay at the prestige room for our night. Don't get too comfortable, though. We won't be staying. Remember to check the purple books at the library. I'll meet you at our spot. See ya. All right, so... Gain access to the library. Between the library and the... Candelabra in the prestige room. Those are the two things I need to jot down. Let me go heal up, though. I'm running into the wall. The barracks are down here. make our way up there now. I even got a heart scale too. Actually, I think I should probably go do some mining. Just because you got the you get the chance to get some really good items. I'm gonna do that. But they may not matter now, but they could come up later. Especially like evolutionary stones we might find. Stuff like that might be really good. Is what I would say if if I could, but they're they aren't back up yet. GG, I guess. All right. Can't wait till I get to use that B bass. I really need a prism scale. I mean, I I think it evolves by prism scale, but I could be wrong. I'm just hoping it evolves by prism scale like the regular one does. 
Uh, purple bookshelf, she said. You found the book with the purple cover Saki mentioned earlier. Read it. This letter is for Robin. If you're not Robin, heck off. Take a stroll through the garden and walk north of the pond. A secret awaits behind the wall of green. If you don't get it, then yikes. But you should. Okay. Is there anything else in here? The books here are interesting. They're all accounts about this so-called Pokemon War. The region is close to Kalos. Could it be speaking about the Kalos War? The tale of the hero and his queen. Read it. Long ago, in the kingdom of Avium, a lone queen looked over our land. The queen had her own appointed knight of light, which she kept safe from harm. At any point of, uh, at any point of adversity, the knight would protect his queen above all else. However, one threat they could not handle creeped up, up, the, uh, up to their door. The hero met his end and fell in battle, leaving his sword lifeless. The enemy presented the sword to her majesty as a symbol of their defeat. The queen would not allow hope to cease. She strung back her bow and shot her final arrow, thus ending the war. So, okay. Well, I gotta say, you can't really be bored here in the castle. There's a lot of books to read and a lot of work to do. Fair enough. Shh, I'm hiding back here. I don't want to do my work, you hear? I mean, don't you just starve if you don't do your work? I don't think they're even forcing you to do your work. You just can't eat. Is there something you need from me? I wanted to speak to you last night, but you were hungry. What? I see. <laughs> okay, yeah. I see. We're just not going to talk about that. Fine. I have no idea what you're talking about, but okay. I want you to keep an eye on Robin and their group. So he, he's just going to ignore that. That's that's interesting. She she probably could have played along a little bit better. This group consists of Valerie Kerasi, Adam Might, and Saki Blakery. What have they done to warrant such a thing? I just have my suspicion. That's all. All right, if you say so. Actually, I'd like to ask you something before I leave. More of a continuation of a past question. You want to know why we allow battling here at the prison? Why we just don't confiscate what they own? Are you going to answer? Let me put it this way. Oh, fuck. No matter the end of this castle plays out, I guess it's something along the lines of it doesn't really matter how the end of this castle plays out. Whether a riot breaks out or complete compliance, we'll get what we want. A riot is fine? At a prison? What? Humor me for a moment. What happens when a riot breaks out? Lots of people get hurt, most of the time innocent. Oh, it goes much further than a, a few more innocent people getting hurt. People die in the most brutal of ways. That's just how things go. So you want your prisoners to die in a riot? Whether they do or not is relevant. You're confusing me, but I'll just think about it. You do that, you're dismissed. That's a very blase response. Whoa. This, this garden looks quite nice. And the Pokemon in here. Told us. Hmm. The shadow that shaved the earth shall be known in the end. The one of raw evil, the one of obsession, the one of betrayal, and the one of greed. Those four shall see the world be lost to forever. Fair enough. Oh my god, finally! That riddle I gave you, if you can even call it that, was made in five minutes. But you solved it, you're a genius. I was barely, it was barely a riddle. I was You're right though. Valerie told me to make it a short notice. I didn't have time to think. Come on, everyone's waiting, let's go. I hope I didn't leave that paper there. What if someone else finds that? There's just a house back here and they don't know about this? That's crazy. Looks kind of nice, though. Earth Ring. Any cool Pokemon back here? Or is it just the same stuff I was finding yesterday? Probably is. Yep. Alright. Let's just move on, then. Everyone, Robin's here. Ooh, a Brakeson. Robin, meet Brakeson. Brakeson, meet Robin. 
Pleased to meet you. My name is Brakeson. The Brakeson can talk. Fair enough. <laughs> Surprised that I can talk? That This is all possible because of Saki's invention. Yeah, Brakeson and I have been friends for a long time. Uh, what is this place? We're not really sure. It's a place the guards definitely don't know about. When we arrived here, Saki found this place while scouting the area, and I'm forever thankful because the sigils placed around the castle were affecting my thoughts. And I'm independent. I don't have a trainer, and I don't want one. So being able to hang back here is wonderful. See? Being nosy can be useful in some cases. Yeah, but sometimes it's hard being back here. It's pretty lonely, and I don't know what goes on in the castle. You don't have to worry too much. We brought Robin here because we want to discuss a plan of escape. That's right. So to start off, we're going to have to find a way to disable those sigils. When Saki messed with one in the mines, a panel asking for a passcode showed up. I'm sure that one uh, that's one way to do it. There may be others. Finding out the passcode is near impossible, though. I, was, uh, I skimmed through some of the bookshelves in the library and did find some numbers, but I don't think any of them have any use here. What, uh, why do you say that? They had more characters. The Pasco only accepts five numbers. Well, then what now? Hey, isn't there a sigil at the garden that's malfunctioning? Maybe we can find something from that. Possible, but there's always a guard station by it. If you guys need a distraction, I'm your gal. You sure that's safe? Nope. And she, there she go. Oh boy, we better follow her and make sure she's uh, she'll be okay. Hmm. Interesting that this place just exists and they don't know about it. Seems to be a book on how to handle domestic abuse. It seems to be owned by someone named Anathea. Do we know any Anatheas? I don't think we know any Anatheas. Fair enough. Miss Blakery, stop running around this instant. Oh, what's wrong, Mr. Guard? Am I causing a scene? Sorry, but I can do whatever I want. I don't care what you say. Stop this or you'll regret it. Tell that to my bony Japanese hat. Okay. Uh, womp, 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 womp. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, shit. What'd she do? Four guards over here. Jesus Christ. Saki's good at being annoying and bringing up the attention to herself. Much to our advantage. You think you can get anything from this? Saki used to tinker with programming machines and all that. Fortunately for us, I had to be there to watch her do all that boring stuff, so I picked up a thing or two. From what I can tell, these sigils are being powered and controlled from elsewhere. These panels that appear can only change the local settings. The local settings? Yeah, like intensity of the signals, how aggressive the control Pokemon should be, all the dark stuff. Really dark. So what you're saying is that we're not able to do anything here. Maybe if we can change the intensity of the lowest setting, some of us can break free. But that can be changed at any time, so it's unreliable. How annoying. Maybe we should stop messing with this for now. We don't want to be caught, and Brakeson needs to get back to the house. Yeah, I'll get going. It was nice meeting you, Robin. Fair enough. As for us, we should get to the dining hall. We can discuss more there. All right, let's go. Dining hall is this way, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Saki's been in herself for misconduct. <laughs> hey, Robin, dinner's not that great as usual. I'm saving a bit for Saki since she's been forcibly placed back into her cell no, uh, with no dinner for the night. Not funny, Adam. She took one for the team there. It's still funny. Hey, so apparently Emma's been in here ever since she lost the tourney. I fail to see that why that's such an issue. You don't find it weird that she's just sitting there doing nothing? Not even eating? Almost as if she's waiting for someone or something to ha- Uh, so not someone. Waiting for something to happen. Val, I think you're being a little paranoid. Oh shit. Emma, here's your dinner for the day. Thank you, I appreciate it. Oh, um, I think you dropped something. I dropped something? Hey, what are you doing? Sorry, you had some dust on your shoulder. I thought I'd look after you and brush it off. Oh, hey, thanks. Have a good night, Emma. You too. She freaking, like, placed a tracer or a tracker or something on him? Okay, that was very strange. You can't say that, wasn't it? There's something up with her, but we knew that already. 
I don't know. I just have this feeling about her. Like she isn't who she says she is. Whatever, you're right. I'm thinking about this. I mean, we already know who she is, but I'm not going to say any names just in case people don't. But we know who that is, right? Like the team of shiny Pokemon, the Togekiss. Oh, okay. <laughs> we know who that is. Night three. Bittersweet reunion. All right, Robin, let's get some things clear. You only won this room for tonight. If you wish to stay here longer, you'll have to win more matches. Dinner's been set on the table. We'll clean up in the morning. Leaving this room is prohibited. Just like your regular self, don't cause a mess. We'll be waking you up at 7 a.m. to escort you out. Don't give us trouble. Good night. Sure. Robin checked underneath the candelabra. Robin found a note. If you're reading this, then you took my advice. Hopefully this is Robin and not someone else. In the end, this is someone, if this is someone else, well, there's nothing I can do. If this is Robin, have, I mean, Jesus Christ, this must be a long ass note. If this is Robin, have a read in this room. If not, go to sleep and don't mention this to anyone. Fair enough. Have a read in this room. I mean, I clearly know why, but I'm just checking just in case something else can, could. All right, yeah, yeah you, I was wondering if you could fat pass this. Robin, look. Remove the third book from the bottom. It's you. It, it really is you. Emma was telling the truth then. I see. I long for the day we, we, uh, we reunited, Robin, but I wish it weren't in this circumstance. Are you okay? Yes, I'm doing just fine now. It's been rough for the both of us, but now we're reunited. And I'm happy. Happy that you're thinking of me. We didn't have much time before, so... I didn't think you loved me, but no, it doesn't matter. This can all wait. We're on limited time. Robin, Emma found her way down here and told me that you were here. She told me she was working for the warden, but I, I think we can still trust her. That girl has good intentions. As for our situation, we're going to need to act quickly. This is how we can save everyone. Please listen closely. Shh. Be quiet. You're going to get me in trouble. Listen, just sit in there and don't pre and pretend to be, uh, just sit in there and pretend to be me. Don't make any noises. I'll be back later. Just behave. First things first, I should check to see if that battleship is still at the docks. The ship is the key to getting everyone off this hell of an island. Battleship key. I really like this like player switching mechanic. It is so good. Makes it feel like 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 it's a, a team of people and not just the protagonist doing everything. It's still here, thank goodness. I should make my way to the control room. I think the key is just gonna be sitting here. There must this must be the control room main uh, interface. Oh, for of course it needs a key. I believe this ship belongs to Nevis. I doubt he'd leave the key to his vessel on board. It's either on him or in his quarters. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. Nevis' room is the third floor. He usually stays up late and stands at the pinnacle of the castle. Maybe I can get away with snooping around a bit. Alright, so I'm guessing I'm not supposed to get caught. I'm not supposed to go that way. Supposed to go that way. I'm guessing it's supposed to go in this way. Okay. Mm -hmm. What uh hmm. You found the book with the purple cover Saki mentioned earlier. <laughs> she technically doesn't know that. This letter is for Emma. If you're not Emma, then heck off. Take a stroll through the garden and walk north of the pond. A secret waits behind a wall of green. 
If you don't get it, then yikes, but you should. It's funny because I think that's supposed to be the player name, but because I'm tech because Ebba is technically the protagonist right now, it's it's this is a nice sprite by the way, like holy crap. Supposed to read this. We already read that though. Are we supposed to do something in this room? sounds like I'm supposed to be in here. Like I'm supposed to be trying to solve a puzzle. Maybe let's try talking to one of these different colored ones. Hmm, wait a minute. There's a black bar underneath that bookcase. I know where I'm supposed to be now. Hiker guy. I saw the work. <laughs> Hiker guy, you're not supposed to be here. I don't think this is the room I'm supposed to be in. Doesn't seem to be anything here. Let's look around though. I kind of felt like I was supposed to come here though. Was I wrong? Never. Where are you hiding this key? What was that? Again. Where's that coming from? A room nearby? I'm sorry, but that's the wrong answer yet again. What the? Aelita! My hand has been forced. Oh my god, Neved! You're a monster! That's enough! Emma! What on earth are you doing, Nevin? I was just giving our little prisoner a little taste of revenge. Not on not on any fault of her own, but her father, Kita. I don't care uh, who she is or who her father is. No one deserves this. I thought you told me you were above torture. You monster. Normally I am. But a certain phrase her father told me long ago rings in my head, and suddenly, there is nothing beneath me but Kita who rests in the ground. Putrid man. Call me what you like, but if you're so concerned with this random girl, then escort her back to her cell, then probably back to yours. If I recall correctly, you're supposed to be there right now. I'm glad I wasn't. Hey, I'll take you back to your bed. Don't worry, I have you now. I, I'm really sorry about Nevis. You don't have to answer back. I just want you to know that this won't last much longer. Who are you to even say that? Uh, who are you to even say that? Just go away. All right, if that's what you want, I'll leave. But know that I'm here to help. I'm going to get everyone off this island. What? Aren't you working with Nevin? For now, but once I get what I need, I'm out of here. And what is it you're looking for? 
That's a secret. Sorry. Figures. I'll be back for you, Aelita. Don't lose hope. Ugh. I was so caught up with Aelita that I forgot to look for that key. The night's still young. I can't go to bed yet. I was told that this castle was littered with secret passageways and hidden corridors. I wouldn't doubt that if there was one in the library. Perhaps I can, uh, perhaps I can find something if I snoop around some more. Yeah, we probably should have looked for the key first. There's a black bar underneath these bookcases, which makes me think. the most off-colored one. I mean... Oh, here we go. Architectural Secrets, Black Seagull Castle, A Mystery Wonder. Well, this doesn't scream exactly what I want. I don't know what will. Huh? What's this? Wow, these are the floor plans of Black Seagull Library. I'm surprised this hasn't been taken away. Maybe they didn't feel like it'd be worth the time. Wait a minute. Something about these floor plans. Something's not quite right. I should study this picture, what the differences are. All right, now. The bookcase isn't on the floor, uh, floor plans. In fact, there should be a door. I think I just found my way through. Well, look who it is. Who the fuck is this? What are you doing up? You should be asleep. So should you, Mole. I heard your conversation. I heard that conversation you had with Nevit. You were eavesdropping? I got ears throughout this castle. You'll never see me, but I'm there. An invisible beast that feasts on, th th on the talk of others. Weird. Weird. I see a rat right in front of me, so uh, so much for invisible. You think you're so clever, but I'll have the last laugh. Just wait till the warden hears about the secret passage that's behind that bookcase. You wouldn't. Try me. I would give you that. I won't give you that chance. That's stupid. Why would she do that? We're trying to get out of here. She over here fucking playing games. Optimus? Let's blow her back real quick. Being typical, weak as hell. That might actually be a problem. Uh, you stronger? Or spear or flamethrower? Feels like a lot of guys there. Much, you know, this is free. Okay, let's calm down there. No need to be so angry. You got swept. W Whoa, okay. Bedtime. Knocked her the fuck out. Now let's see what's behind this door. I would have punched her out too. Good job, Emma. There's a note for Saki on your bed. Um, Robin, there's trouble at you know where. Please come meet us. Yeah. Let's look at the PC, what Pokemon I should bring. Probably should bring an electric type, but what do I take off? Um, I think I'm fine. Moving at sonic speed. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see. You know where. I am actually gonna, before I go there, and I will, I wanna go check and see if I can do some mining, though. So they said they respawn every day, but I guess that's not true. I guess it's whatever then. What the heck? What's going on? Emma. Well, as you can see, we have a small problem. Um, actually, it's a pretty big problem. 
She just walked in here last night out of nowhere, but if you knuckleheads would just stop and listen for a second, she could explain herself. Explain herself? She's already done that by joining Nevit. Yo, can y'all shut up for a second? Can I explain that too, if you just give me a chance? We might as well. She's already here. Fine. But if we're not convinced, you will be. I just need a second. Okay, we don't have time to sit around asking questions, so I'll get to the point. I'm a double agent. I'm only working for Nevit so that I have free roam of the castle. My goal is to get everyone off this island before it's too late. That's a cute story, but I still don't see any evidence. You can ask Robin. I purposefully lost against them so that... Damn, don't undermine my win. I purposefully lost against them so that they can reunite with someone they lost. What? The prestige room. There's a secret, and, uh, secret area behind the bookcase. When you go through it, there's a gigantic secret area. It's where Team Zen is keeping the mechanism for the sigil. It's also where they're keeping the passengers of the ocean, uh, the ocean liner, the SS Oceana. I can also vouch, uh, vouch that what she said is true. How? She showed me the secret passage where she came through that uh, led directly to that area. That person Robin lost was their mother. I spoke to her myself for reference. All right, I'll, I'll trust you, but if I even get an inkling of suspicious behavior, I understand, do what you must, but I'm serious. In that, I mean, I could also vouch for that because I saw the other side of that. I was in the procedures room. Interesting that I don't feel the need to say that, but it is whatever. In that case, how will you go through it all this? <laughs> I have a plan, a plan that leaves no room for error, but that's just the nature of our situation, isn't it? Go on. A few nights ago, I, sn uh, I snooped around the docks. I saw a huge ship that would hold all of us. The only problem is that it requires a key to turn on. I suspected that it might have been in Nevid's possession, but I walked in on Nevid, on Nevid torturing Arlita with electricity. She's been uh, she's being held on the lower floors of the castle. No one's seen her because she's only been out at night. In my haste to help Arlita, I forgot about the key. I'm sorry. Don't be. You did the right thing. But what will, we, uh, what will we do now? We need that key for the ship. Don't give up hope. I've rethought my strategy. Here's what I thought of so far. First, we'll have Valerie win a tournament so that she can win a night in the prestige room. Oh, no food tonight again, I guess. When night falls, Valerie will pull Saki and breaks in up to the prestige room. You three will follow the secret path down to the hidden mine. The mine carts are sent out when there is approximately 45 pieces of ore loaded in the cart to make sure everyone uh, make sure there's enough to send through. To make sure there's enough to send through, send through. Adam's going to be the Adam's going to mine as many rocks as he can. Why did I have trouble reading that? <laughs> This way she can stack up the 45 ores for breaks in Isaki to get to the control room. <laughs> the three of them will meet up with Nancy and destroy the sigil control room when I give the signal. That signal will be communicated by this radio I stole from one of the guards. We're down the main control panel ever. Whenever. Robin will await in their room until the sigils are disabled. Then they'll lead the rebellion from the lower floors and take out the guards. Fair enough. As for me, I'll go back to Nevin and try my best to find that key. After all, that's the most important part of this mission. All right, this must be our last night here. Let's get bread. Let's get this bread. Nevin, are you in there? I need to talk to you. Yes, come in. It's good you came. I wanted to talk to you too. Oh, what about? Probably best for you to go first. Fine with me. I want to talk to you more about this place. I hope you don't mind, but I took a stroll down the pier where you found me, and I noticed there was a ship there. I was dumbfounded by its marvelousness. That's my ship. I was, uh, it was given to me when I adopted this castle. Wow, I wouldn't exactly call myself a ship aficionado, but I do enjoy observing certain vessels. Is that so? But when this is all over, I can take it for a ride. Well, how about that? I was wondering if we could do one today. I'm just really excited to see it in motion, you know? Unfortunately, that is impossible. Why? I was really excited to go for a ride, too. You remind me of my daughter. Young, spunky, enthusiastic. 
She'd always ask me to take her out for rides along the sea. I don't blame her. It's an experience. Nevertheless, it's impossible. It seems this place is going to, uh, going to an end today. Com uh, coming to an end? Why did I say going to an end? Coming to an end. A few days ago, I received notice that we've met our quota and that Madame X will be appearing soon. What? You're surprised? Do you happen to know that name? The key. I need the key to your ship. Excuse me? If Madame X is coming, then I can't stay here. Alex, one of the guards down by the pier to take me away from this island. If you fear for your life, I wouldn't. I will protect you. I've already told Madame X of your involvement and she improves your efforts here. In fact, when this is all over, she may ask you to become an admin. I, I can't. I just... I understand. Will you feel better if I give you a key? Yes. Why did he give her the key there? That is the weirdest thing for her to him to do. Do you plan on leaving now? I mean, I knew she had to get the key just so the story could progress, but like giving her the key right here is just really strange. Cause like, what? Is he just saying she can take it and leave? Like, just make sure you're on the ship by the afternoon. I guess that's what he's saying. Valerie, Saki, we need to talk. Something's come up. Hello, can you hear me? Something's wrong. Why isn't Valerie answering? This isn't good. I need to go find Robin. And I'm just standing here. Robin, thank goodness you're awake. What's up? I went to Nevitt's room as planned, but he told me something that can ruin everything. Apparently, Madame X is making her way here to the island as we speak. She's expected to get here by the afternoon. If that happens, none of us will be able to take her on, no matter how strong we're all combined. Okay. Where are the others? I don't know. I've tried contacting them like planned, but they won't respond. I fear they might have been caught or something, but if they were, I'm sure Nevit would have said something to me, so I'm not sure. You're gonna, yeah, he wouldn't have given you the key if that were the case. That's just strange. You're gonna have to go check in them, check on them. I'd do it, but Nevit will, Nevit will find out I'm gone. Here, I'll get you out of your cell. You don't have time to wait. Once you get down there, deactivate the sigils. I'll go down to the cellar and save Aelita from her confinement and lead the rebellion with her. Huge problem though. Getting there is going to cause us trouble. Uh, trouble. The prestige room has been completely locked out, and because of Madame X's arrival, all tournaments have been canceled. But I have an idea. A few days ago, I lashed a sticker on a guard within his, without his notice, and began to monitor his movements. He went through the doors in the cafeteria, then somehow later appeared through the library at night. That's how I found out about the tunnel. From there, the secret hideout behind the garden. What I'm trying to say is, there are dozens of tunnels and passageways throughout the castle. The one from the procedure room can't be the only one that exists. I believe the very same passageway from the library may eventually lead there if you do some digging. Going through the library itself may be too risky. Going through the entrance I opened up by the hideout may be our best bet. Good luck, Robin. We're going to need it. Fair enough. Okay. We gotta make our way in and find them. She said, go from here. Hmm. But this part of the wall looks weird. Push it. What the? Huh? Uh, uh, and the... That just walked through that wall? So what's this whole place is for? That's what Nevit told me anyway. Apparently after the failure at Keratos in Goldenwood Forest, Madame X proposed this plan, to capture and destroy all of the strong changes of the region. I can understand kidnapping Valerie and the other leaders. What about the civilians of Akula Town? Bait, probably. Bait for whom? The one who st uh, started this all, uh, uh, the one who started this all. That strong trainer from Garen City. Supposedly their name is Robin. Talk about the worst. Dang, I got a reputation. I, I'm pretty good. Soft resetting works wonders for being a Pokemon trainer. Right, this one right here. Go through the wall. Am I walking through the wall? What's exactly happening there? So you it is were finally smart enough to find this passageway, huh? Well get this, idiots. I prepared for this moment. I bet you didn't even see me hide uh see me hide underneath the table, huh? Now I'm gonna Who the fuck knocked me out. Wait a second. It's the piano lady. She jumped the crap out of me. <laughs> you Robin. I, I'm i so sorry. I didn't mean to slug you like that. I never expected you to just walk through the hidden corridors here. 
I thought a guard finally found me all the way back here. But no, it's you. That means they got you too. Uh, I'm here to help. In that case, I'm here to support. Believe it or not, I've met your friend already. They snuck down here earlier, and by here I mean the cells. But I'm usually I uh, but I usually hang in here because it's where I want to be, not where those criminals want me to be. This room is connected to my cell. Here, come take a look. Huh. Fair enough. See? It's hidden behind a bookcase. Because of that, I can roam out at night and not get in trouble. Your friend should be in the next room over. There aren't any guards down here, but be careful. Uh, let's save it just because... Lots of talking. Next room over. Uh, I'm guessing she means... Does she mean down? Or... Yeah. This is the place to be, right? I'm guessing. Oh. That means it's time for a battle. Let's see. Uh, oh, this is the mo uh, our mom's cellar. Our cell, not cell. Oh, they got knocked out. What happened here? Would you look at that? Seems the insect finally fell in our web. Oh crap! Looks like they were. Uh, looks like you were right. This uh, looks like you were right, Madeline. Things fell into place exactly as envisioned. Beauty and brains. What a pair! I can't help being this marvelous. So Robin thought. Uh, Ross. So Robin thought you could just waltz in and mess up our plans. A bold move from someone who got themselves locked up in prison. As they say, if you can't do the time. Uh, you can't do the time. Don't do the crime. Let's sweep this up quickly. Madame X will be here soon, and we don't want this to be our fr uh, the first thing she sees. We're not going down without a fight. Who's my backup? Mom! Oh shit! <laughs> oh my god! You Mother's Day is gonna be crazy. I owe her the world. You two were so caught up in knocking out those three that you didn't even notice me hiding behind the machines. Great. Now we have to deal with this sorry excuse. Fine. Let's get this over with. I'll take. A, uh, I'll take care. I'll take, I think she, there's, there's a care missing, but I'll take care of Nastasia. You take care of Madeline's. What? Not good enough for you? So disgusting. All right, Madeline, let me put you in the fucking ground real quick. I'm tired of you and that tattered on self. Oh, shit. This might be a problem. Oh, never mind. I was faster. Salas. This Pokemon. Did I transform this cave into a dragon cave? Fair enough. Gorgeous. I technically... Oh, I do have fairy type. I don't think I have any fairy type though. This is Madeline. Not that big a deal. Ain't no sludge bomb. And it keeps off from the attack. Oh. Looks like my terrain backfired. Then. Fair enough. I'm going with a focus ash. Get this out of here. Serenade. Let's just pyro ball our way to four. There we go. Very nice. This ended another failure. That was annoying. What's wrong with you? Sad because you lost again? Happens, there's no cure for incompetence, but I suppose the same could be said of me. See, my mom is a freaking crazy battler too. All right. I'm not dumb, and I know when to quit, so we'll back off for now. But let's see if you can get every single person off this island before Madame X arrives. You're right, Nastasia. This outcome is superior. Watching you hooligans run around aimlessly is a hope, so uh, 
uh, in hopes of escape will bring tears to my eyes. Out of laughter, of course. Let's leave, Masasia. That was uh, that was definitely a gambit waiting for someone to show up, I mean. I used your friends as a distraction. I must apologize to them. But I'm glad you're okay. That's what matters the most to me. Got it. Uh, what next? Got to disable the signal. I missed you. I missed you too. I'm sorry our reunion had to happen like this, but it'll all be over soon. Let's disable the signal and make sure that uh, they can't just re-enable it later. Come on. Let's wake your friends and begin. Youchi wouchi. What the fuck? That shit hurt it. <laughs> oh my god, bro. <laughs> Perhaps freeing in your mom. Like, uh, perhaps freeing your mother so soon was a bold decision. I think we might have gotten caught by a hidden surveillance cam or something. That woman, Nastasia, really was strong. Stronger than Saki, even. Yeah, I kind of got bonked on the head, and that was all. Oh, well, it happens. It, uh, it all turned out well in the end, didn't it? Yes, and now we must do what we were assigned to. Let's disable the Sigil's power source once and for all. Alita, I'm here for you. What? What are you doing? I'm getting you and everyone else off this island right now. Are you able to fight? Yes, I mean, what? How can we fight? They have those things that to prevent us. Robin is taking care of that as we speak. It has begun. What has begun? Don't talk in such a scary way. Sorry, sorry. Come on, I'll explain the way. Wow, it's already all smoky and harsh out here. Emma and Adam must have noticed that the signal just finally died down. Word of this must have spread, and well, this is the result. We're breaks and leading all of the survivors of the SS Oceana through the library's hidden passage. Everything's falling into place. <coughs> Ooh, sorry. <coughs> we don't know what's happening at the castle yet, though. For all we know, things might be going down poorly. We have to regroup with Emma and Adam. Be right back. I need to drink some, some water. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Hiccups are gone. <laughs> that was a bit uncomfortable. Down poorly. We have to regroup with Adam and uh, Emma and Adam. Then we'll get everyone boarded on the ship. We don't have much time. Roger, let's go. Robin, let's fight together this time. With our strength, we're unstoppable. Let's show them the power we hold. Are you ready to go? Let's get them. Come on, let's leave this wretched prison. Yeah, this let's go. What? Where did you come from? I don't think you need to worry about that. Ooh, that's rough. Dude, most of my team is super injured. One, but you have no idea what's in store for you all. What the fuck does that mean? Enough. Just surrender. I don't think we will. Just stand outside. Oh, God. They're laid out. What happened to the sizzle? They just lost power all of a sudden. We cut the power, so now, you have, uh, now you're all left wide open. Dang, they got laid out. This is so bad. This is so, 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 so bad. I don't even know what to do right now. You let us leave, do nothing. Do I have to go around for real? Yeah, we do. Interesting. Wait a minute. Isn't that... Did the SS Oceana prisoners escape their cells? We're free and we'll never be enslaved again. I keep getting intimidated because... Okay. 
Nevit won't stand for this. Your rebellion is fruitless. Fuck Nevit. <laughs> what? I've never been much of a battler. That's fine. But Nevit's been battling life for his, uh, battling life for his entire well life. You don't have to experience the you don't have the experience to beat him. We don't need experience to handle this situation. Back off. You guys are helping. Our guests have become rowdy, and on today of all days, sir, the SSOTIANA printers have been freed. Not only that, but the prisoners on the lower levels have been released too, including Aelita. Where is Emma? I don't know. None of us have been. Uh, none of us. None of us have seen her for a while. Hmm. Gather the guards and protect the castle. I'll make my way to the castle's pinnacle. We need everyone to be calm, even if you have to resort to destroying them. Madame X will be here soon. Even if this place is in chaos, we have to make sure she's placed with whatever's going on. I'm afraid I don't understand, but I'll do my best. See to it. Oi, Nancy, is that you? And by the gods, that's Robin. Wait a mom what a momentous reunion this is. Augustus, you've made it out okay. That spunky breaks and let us out of uh, that stuffy cell. Now I may not be a youngin, but I can still fight. No fighting for you, sir. We have a ship we need you to sail for us. That's a job I can do for sure. I suppose there's more suited that's more suited to my skill set. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Emma, it's good to see you again. Is there something the matter? The key never gave me earlier, I suspect it might have this might have happened, but I had nothing else to go off of. What's wrong with the key? The key isn't for the ship that's docked by the pier. I don't know if Nevis expected me or if he didn't want me to leave, but Emma. Oh, he's shouting. Yeah. This is what you're looking for, correct? I always keep the key to my ship around my neck. If you wish to gain access to my ship, you better make your way to the pinnacle of the Black Steeple Castle. Make haste. Your time is running out. Ooh, the song. Okay. Emma, you're not actually going to the pinnacle, are you? I'm getting that key, no matter what. I came here to save everyone, and I won't let Nevit get in the way of that. Nevit won't let us leave. He's in the way. I knew it would come to this, eventually. I understand. In that case, let Robin come with you. I know we just reunited, and it pains me to see you go again, but in this short time, we've been back, uh, in this short time we've been back together, I've realized that I have to let go. You've come so far on your own. You don't need me anymore. My purpose? It's been fulfilled so long ago. Augusta and I will take part in gathering people and escorting them to the ship. We'll all be patiently waiting for you to return with the key in hand. Do you understand? I won't let you down. That's what I like to hear. Go get him, Robin. This song is awesome. Holy crap. I like this song. That's right. We'll be successful. Oh, Emma, if it comes to it, don't forget what we talked about. It won't come down to that. Don't worry. Let's be on our way, Robin. We got a job to do. Alita says she can help with the rebellion within the castle. We should meet up with her and make our way to the pinnacle. Let's do this, Robin, for everyone else. This song is awesome. Holy crap. I'll stop any more guards from entering. We must gain control of the castle. What's up, you doing? I got this area covered. No more guards will come up from the barracks. Let's fight the power. Yo, this Sapini though. Who Sapini is this? They just ran through all them guards. There's no way. Where are all the guards coming from? I don't remember seeing this many guards before. Adam, I have this floor covered. You gotta confront Nevit and get the key. We're rooting for you. I mean, that Sapini could probably solo this whole place. Safe outside. Let's make our way. Alita, there you are. We've been looking for you. Oh, Emma, I was just looking around Nevis' room to see if maybe he was hiding another key in here. I 
heard him earlier. When, uh, I heard him earlier when he was yelling at you all at the ground. I thought maybe the key he was holding wasn't the right one either, so I took it upon myself to look around here just in case. Fair enough. That's... Huh? Oh. Robin, I didn't want you to see me like this. Are you okay? Me? You worried about me? Bro, Alita, you're like my friend, dude. Like, oh my god, man. I was, I was crying because they took you and they were... I didn't know where you were. Like, I thought you'd be worse off. Yes, I'm okay. Thank you for asking. It's been rough, but I can keep going. Let's get a move on then. Right. Siege begins. I'm gonna start. Uh, I don't know his best, so it's probably best to lead with my best Pokemon. Not, not Nevid. Oh, he's not here. This castle is cool. So you've come. Do you know what the price to pay for treason is? Nevit, this isn't a game. Give me that key now. No. Nevit, do you understand what you're uh, subjecting the people here to if you don't? How can you just sit there on that throne fully knowing what our fate is to be? The passengers of the SS Oceana, the people of Akua Town, all will be lost to your leader, Madam X. Please do the right thing. I'm begging. I am aware. It's all for the sake of my daughter. The lives of strangers are the life of the one person that matters to me the most. People die every day. This is a sacrifice I'm willing to make for her. But are you willing to kill them is another question. Perhaps she doesn't approve. Maybe she'll hate me forever. But the gift I've given her will keep her safe. I was someone's daughter too, you know. But you tortured me. For a reason I still don't know. You kept me locked up away from Robin. You wish no harm on her, but... You what? Uh, but you did what scares you. But you did what scares you most to me. Do you feel any guilt at all? You're Kita's daughter. That is all it takes for me to resent you. But enough, bro. Did Kita like fuck your bitch or something? Like that's crazy. What? Why did you? Why did you torture this girl personally? For well, what did Kita do to you? I need to know. I have to know. I need to know what Kita did to him. Kita touched him the wrong way or something. I don't know. <laughs> but enough chatter. We all know what this land went. The lives of strangers are the life of the one person who means the most to me. I've chosen my path. I know my answer. For you all, I've chosen death. And we chose life. Robin, let's go. Alright, Nevid. Complicated things. Really wish you went for a flying type move on a tentacle, but it's fine. Tentacle is actually not that strong. So. And I keep. Pilot. Whoa! That's not a pile of sand. That's a pile of snow. And I missed. I hate to see it. Out of the game. Alright, so I have an idea. Flying type Pokemon. Yes, very nice. Good job. Not nice. Kill that thing. Barbarical. We need to kill this, otherwise, we will get hurt. Or we die to rock slide. 
my leader isn't out of Pokemon like this. No, she isn't. She might be, though. I think I might be her last one. Ugh. It is her last one. I was really hoping that did more damage. Oh, cool. We made it. We made it. My answer, my resolve. Did it hold no conviction? No power? What will fate bring me? This belongs to us now. I don't want to hear your damn. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to damn your daughter to her fate. But this isn't right. Whatever you think the solution is, it's not what this is. And what? Tell fucking tell him. <laughs> that's not. Yeah, that's not our problem. <laughs> Sorry to say it, but I'm not gonna die for your daughter. And what do you know? You know nothing. All of you are ignorant to our situation. Doesn't matter if we're ignorant. We fight for what we believe in. This castle's mission failed because we had the resolve to see our belief through. Is that what you think? If that's the case, I'm here to challenge that. Oh no. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way any Veltal's here. She's here. So early. Oh shit, she is here. This is Madame X. Ma'am I enough. I don't want to hear it. I put you in charge of my castle. This is what you have to show? A disturbingly incomplete display? But I suppose I didn't expect anything more from you to begin with. F forgive me. These children, these are the ones that gave you this much trouble? But these aren't ordinary trainers. I lead her from Sheridan Village, the shadow of her former self. The mystery girl Emma, the one supposedly on her way to Neverwinter. And finally Robin, the one I've heard so much about. In fact, you're the one who's caused me the most amount of trouble. You're the one who inspired me to give this wretched castle a purpose. I suppose uh, I suppose one could, would call it fate that we encounter each other like this. What countless strings of events has fate brought about? Don't talk about us like you know who we are. Ailita, don't. Your soul is filled with fire. Fire that doesn't seem to belong to you. How curious. Doesn't it belong to me? Guys, you can't be here right now. We have to go. Go? That can't happen. This is your final stand. Robin! You continue to impress me, but your impressions only get you so far. Fine then. If you wish to save your friends, let's see what your strength can really do. Oh boy. <coughs> oh, oh no. Um... Double shit. Fair enough. And the hiccups are back. <laughs> okay, I think I'm good. <laughs> well, no, I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Not yeah. enough. Maybe I could... Alright then. I mean, I can at least get one hit, right? Didn't think so. Uh... No? I had to pay her money? God damn, my father gave her 20 bucks for that. Somehow I expected more to come from you, Robin. It's clear to me now that the only reason why you made it this far was because my subjects were incompetent. That's not entirely inaccurate. You can't just trust anyone to do anything. It always has to come from yourself. But you all, but you all don't understand that sentiment, do you? You go on about this so-called unity of friendship and then lose tact when the gun is pointed to your head. You've got a fucking Evelto with a one-hit KO priority move. What the hell are you talking about? Don't be ashamed of yourselves, though. That is human nature but I won't fall in such a category. We're at our end. We've got to get out of here. No more running, no more cowering. It all ends with you, Robin. Robin. What? My disguise. This can't be. 
What is going on here? I don't know. What's happening to Emma? What is the meaning of this? This girl is Emma? It cannot be. Ugh. That did not feel good at all. Huh? Wait, no. Are you... I, I do know... I, do you know who I am? I knew it. I felt it. Our bond did not dissipate. When I was told your death, I had no choice but to believe it. However, I knew deep within my core that you'd not left this world. Melia. That, that's impossible. Zeta said... Zeta is absent. So is Gira. And that treacherous professor. Uh, what I see before me is worth more than anything this establishment could have ever achieved. Physical proof that things have not yet ended for us. I've long awaited for this day, and now it has finally come. I've done the same, but it won't be uh, it won't be the conclusion you're looking for. I came to this island to rescue my friend, a friend that rescued me so long ago. You came to save me? Of course. I never abandoned you, Robin. No matter what circumstance, through time, space, you're my trusted friend, and I will never forget what you've done for me. Oh man, Melly is a oh my god! All right, come here, come here. Eileen, she's she trying to take best girl. She's trying to take best girl. And I don't, I can't, I can't hold myself back. <laughs> that being said, I haven't saved you yet. And I'm not sure how I'm going to. Uncertainty is a weakness when you hesitate. You lose everything. Time. I won't hesitate. I'm prepared to lose even myself for it. On that note, I think we should, yeah, we should get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Abel Tall is just chilling. <laughs> not this time. Not again. End of the line. Ooh. Falling noises. Are we good? What the? Uh, I know I haven't been out of my cell often, but I don't remember this platform being here. It wasn't here before. Robin and Ailita, you're stubborn sta you stubborn stacks of poo. I tried to warn you, but you two wouldn't listen. Wait a minute. I remember that voice. I knew it! Nim! Girl, you look insane! What happened to you? Long story. I'll tell you about it later. Robin, you look fine as usual. And who's this? My name is Melia. Nice to meet you, Melia. My name's Nim, and I'm here to break your fall. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are now beginning our descent. As of now, it's a very clear scratch, uh, clear scratch, that It seems we're getting a bit of flurry. But the heat coming from this sick landing is melting the snow as it's coming down on mine. Oh my god, what? It doesn't stop Nim, uh, Pilot Nim from protecting her passengers from the scary scenario her friends are in. Thank you for flying with Nim Airlines. We hope to see you again. Nim, you're awesome, but we need to get the hell out of here. Nim, that was amazing. This sudden change in weather is bizarre. Don't worry, dudes and dudettes. I try my best. I don't know what, uh, I don't want to ruin your fun. But we have a homicidal terrorist organization leader who's just on top of that castle. Yeah, she's, yeah, she is. And we want to kill all of... Ooh, I'm sorry. She wants to kill all of us, Nim included. So we should get that, uh, we should head to the docks. Uh, I don't want to be killed, so let's get the heck out of here. Agreed, come on. Things were quite down, uh, quiet down inside. I can only hope that means everything's settled and ready to go. Even if it isn't, can we risk leaving immediately? I don't think so. Oh, thank heavens you all made it out all right. Everyone's already on the ship. We're ready to go whenever. Don't have to tell me twice. Nim, wait up. Who's this, I wonder? I wonder, is this Melia? The name Emma told me, uh, was her true name? Uh, hello. Turns out I was hiding more than just my name. No need to worry. I figured you were. Oh, no. What was that? We need to go now. What's going on? It's Madame X. She wasn't supposed to arrive yet, but... Madame X? No, she won't just let us leave. Not without. Robin, Melia, please get yourselves on the ship. When you do, tell Augustus to get everyone out of here immediately. W what? We can all escape if we just leave right now. No, she'll follow us to the ends of the earth if she gets the chance. Bro, she's after you? She's got an Aveltal, and you're right here? And that Aveltal is probably faster than the ship. Like, we, somebody's got to do something about that thing. I won't give her that chance. Uh, yeah, we, we all, we got to figure something out. 
I understand your feelings, but I've made my decision. I'll be back before you know it, okay? I don't like this. Please come with us. Remember what we discussed before, Melia. It's time. What do you mean by that? But I just... I don't know if I... Robin, I understand how you feel, but we can't stay any uh, we can't stay here any longer. Your mother has made up her mind. She'll stand her ground here. Fair enough. I guess. Sorta. This is what they left behind? The soulless disgrace? What do you mean about that? A soulless disgrace. I don't know. Uh I know you didn't just come here to talk, Madam X. I won't let you leave this dot. Sylvia. Are you expected this to hold me? Of course not. It'll buy the time I need to get everyone off this horrible island. A challenge, uh, a challenge well accepted. Bro, use the Avelton. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Sylveon's reflect is strong. We trained in secret deep below the castle. All for this moment where I would sacrifice everything for Robin. Because my love for them exceeds my fear of you. Dang, man. Fear has completely left you, you say? That's utter nonsense. But for... Uh, Wow, she's actually piercing you. Even with some, uh, when someone makes the ultimate sacrifice. Fear riddles a person to their core. That is because fear is what drives humans to survive. Without it, we'd be nothing but soulless, uh, soulless, we'd be nothing but souls lost to the wind. Even now, when I shatter your pitiful barrier with each crack, a shiver is sent throughout your soul, uh, soon to be lifeless corpse. I don't want to die. Maybe should have ran a little bit sooner than that. <laughs> yes, that's right, Happy. Bro, can I send out my Altaria to help or like maybe Cinderace some Pyro Balls or something? My mom's not about to get freaking slapped. Holy crap, that was exactly really cool. Togedy. I'm almost there. Just a few more steps. I've done everything I could for them, Robin. I want you to be happy above all else. I thought this was because of her, but I realized that it's because of me. This is what I want. Hmm. Robin, this is, is what's best for you. Goodbye. No. Oh, my sprite change is back. Fair enough. Robin. Oh no, let's bring Robin inside. Nancy, I'm sorry. Yo. Oh my god. This is the reality of your existence. Domination and fear reign supreme. Childish things such as love have no bearing over raw strength. However, there is something to be said about resolve. Although futile, I must say that I am impressed. There's no point in chasing. Our paths will cross again. But know that your doom has already been written. The game has been set and I've already won. Yeah, I gotta put Madame X in a body bag real quick, but I'm not strong enough. Holy crap, I'm not strong enough. One week later. <clears throat> so how long are we going to just let them sit there? I don't know. They didn't seem interested in speaking to any of us before. Robin only really comes out when it's time to eat and then quickly go back. I don't know what's going through their head, but it can't be good after, you know. You guys think too much. I'll be right back. Hey Robin, it's been a week now, but you've been cooped up in this room ever since. Just wanted to come and say that we're all here for you. We're worried. And I guess I decided to come check on you because I feel pretty guilty. I don't let no one intimidate me. If I were there, maybe things would have been different. Not your fault. Yeah, well, I feel guilty anyways, but whatever. What if situations are stupid to think about anyway? Anyway, Emma, or I mean, Melia, wanted to talk to you. She's on the main deck, 
but she also said if you weren't up to talking, that's fine. She's somewhere on the main deck. Holy crap, things just got crazy. Let's see. There's a note on the Pokeball from Augustus. Read it. Hello there, Robin. I'm really sorry and saddened by what happened to your mother. She was always brave and did things without thinking, as you saw. However, I must tell you something. She predicted her death ever since we were locked up in that cell. She knew it was inevitable. She wanted me to give you this, if anything ever happened to her. This was a spawn for her from her own Mawile. She wanted to give you a gift to remember her by. Your mother truly loved you. If only we all made it out. Fair enough. Hmm. Not wild. Party's full of missing. Probably off the game. Yeah, that nature kind of sucks. Fire Fang, Crunch, Baton Pass, and it's that. Hmm. I could probably use this as the game progresses, but I'm definitely, I mean, a, a Steel type. But Mawile without its Mega is kind of rough. Hmm. I think I'll hold off on it. For the moment. Absolutely a, a potential Pokemon to use. Alright. Now that everything's over with that black sequel, can't say I have too much to look forward to. Wish something uh wish I had something to bring back my purpose in life. I'm so very sorry, Robin. If I could play you a song I would. We're all thinking of you. Really sorry about your mom. Sorry, I don't know how to do these things. Sorry, right, Nim. You, you did save my life. I can't be mad at you. Where am I, where am I going? That's uh, it's all pretty crazy what's going on, man. I wasn't expecting all this. Oh, here we go. Um, hello? Robin, are you doing all right? How are you feeling? We've been worried sick about you ever since, well, I'm just glad to see you out here. Yes, it's good to see you. Robin, I just wanted to tell you I'm sorry I am, I am for what happened. I truly wanted to bring your mother with us, but when I spoke with her deep within the castle dungeon... What? You can't be serious. I can't allow this. Please, Emma. In the event that Robin's life is in danger, allow me to sacrifice, uh, sacrifice myself for there and everyone's safety. How could you ask something so cruel of me? You're not wishing to see you throw away your life. If we work together, we can... It's all right. I've decided this. I've made my peace. I was just following her wishes. That was her final request of me. I'm sorry. It's okay. Thank you for understanding. It means a lot to me. If there's anything you could be uh, that could be said about your mother, it's that she was on one of the bravest people to throw her life away to save ours, especially yours. That's a sacrifice I won't ever forget. Anyway, putting that behind us, there's something I wanted to ask you, Melia. Was your quest to save Robin the only reason why you were at Black Sepal? That was my biggest reason, but it wasn't my only clue. I was also sent to investigate the castle and discover the reason why Team Zen held so many people up in that castle. I found some interesting things, but notably that Black Steeple Island is comprised of two land masses and two castle structures. I saw the second castle for myself while snooping about at night, but couldn't get close to it. There was, there was some kind of, there, wait, there was what seemed to be a barrier surrounding it for some reason. A barrier? That must mean it's protecting something. Yes. And through some more snooping, I learned that whatever they're hiding there is so secret that not even Zen admins are authorized entry. Something so secret that Zen admins aren't even allowed entry? So that would mean only Madam X is allowed to roam that castle. What could be so secret that they are willing to bar off even their own members? Your guess is as good as mine, but the thought scares me quite a bit. Same here. I don't even want to think about it. Besides trying to kill us, was the uh, was there? Hmm. Uh, besides trying to kill us, was there any other reason to kidnap us? Nevin something. Nevin said something about trying to gather energy from humans. 
He said that conflict and battle created a special type of energy. What they need for that energy is also the dark. Okay, I'm done talking about this. I seriously feel so uncomfortable. I'm gonna go chill on the deck for now. I'll see you guys later. Yeah, she needs a break. I guess this stuff is pretty dark. I hope it didn't really scare her. She'll be fine. Aelita is strong, but I guess I should head, uh, head back inside too. How long until we reach Akua Town again? Should arrive early in the morning. I won't be long. Right, thanks. Man, this is some dialogue. <laughs> Perhaps I should head back inside as well. It's pretty chilly out here. If you need someone to talk to, please don't hesitate to approach me. <clears throat> hmm. Where are you going? Go. Oops. Where are you going? Robin, I didn't expect to run into you so soon, and in here of all places. Since this ship was built for sparring, I mean, uh, I suppose it is a battleship. I don't know. This room's just been calling me lately. Hey, Robin. How about we have a battle? It's been a long time since our last one. Sort of. I mean, we did fight in the castle, but okay. we still have a whole day until we reach a cool town. This will help pass the time. Besides, I want a rematch. I'm gonna win this time. Lion. Are my Pokemon good? Just gotta make sure. We'll leave Ace. Okay. <clears throat> strength is important, but there's much more to battle than strength alone. It's important to remain diligent and to treat your opponent as equals. Underestimating your opponent will only result in a loss. Okay. Robin, you've gotten so strong, but so have I. Alright, Malia. Let's see how strong you really are then. Ooh, you got predicted. Okay. You didn't get really you didn't really get predicted. Stomping tantrum. Probably should have just switched out when I could have, but I guess it's fine. That's annoying. Toga kiss. I mean, I know the move she has. I didn't know she had that. That's a new move. Start of war. Um. Uh, I don't want to lose Aria. I just don't have a lot of Pokemon to switch into. I need to heal up. Surprise of healing increases the crit chance. <laughs> Snorlax. Oh, that's bad. I'm gonna have to work on this one. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice, Cacturn. Duo Blade. And this should be easy. Even now, the result is still the same. <laughs> Makes me happy. <laughs> Even after all that training, I still wasn't able to beat you. But somehow, I'm happy you won. It's nice to know everyone's improving. Anyway, like I said before, we'll be docking at a at Akua Town in the morning. Soon after, we'll start our voyage to Oceana Pier and drop off Aelita, the SS Oceana people, and you off. After that, I'll be off on my own again, back to where I came from. It was fun. Good night, Robin. Where did you come from? And how are we just gonna leave? What? Just, what? There's 
No way. Oh well. Lots of questions. Um, this was a crazy episode. Like, a lot happened. My mom passed away, but... Man, the story's getting really good. Anyways, if you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and see you next time. Uh, stay tuned. This is getting really good, and I'm, I'm enjoying it. Holy crap. Uh, take care.